I have missed you all so much. So as you can tell, I'm in a new room because I moved and I got a new bed. Sorry about that. I got a new bed. I'm actually sitting on it right now. It is gorgeous. Oh my god, I can't wait to show you guys um, my new bed, my new room. Because I will be doing a room tour, a very long overdue room tour. Um, that will be coming up soon. Oh, I'm so excited. Can you believe we're at the end of November? Today's November 29th. Thursday's the 1st of December. And then before we know it, we'll be at Christmas. This whole month has flown by like that. It really, really has, you guys. So let's get started with my favorite things for the month of November. Yay. OK, so first thing is um, I'm going to start off with books. Now, as you guys know, I'm currently reading the Harry Potter series on audible.com. If you have not heard of Audible, like go to their website. They're amazing. Download the app. It's free. You can like download any audiobook. Um, I think you, your first trial is free, and then then you can just pay. Like I think I think it's like I think it's fifteen dollars um, to subscribe or something. But it, it explains on the website. Um, but yeah, I love Audible. Love it. Love it. So I'm currently reading Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix. So that is book number five. I'm currently on chapter eleven. So yeah, love it. Really, really good. Okay, next book that I just finished, actually finished reading, it didn't take me that long actually, was Matilda by Roald Dahl and it was narrated by Kate Winslet and she did a brilliant job at narrating the movie, uh, narrating, oh, narrating the book, oh, whoop, whoop, sorry, oopsies, I clicked on the book, oops, but yeah, Matilda, so this is what the book looks like, that's what the cover looks like, and it goes for about four hours and 19 minutes, so it's not too long. It's not a long book. But yeah, I loved it. I listened to it pretty much mm, like the majority of the, like towards the end of the move. I just like, just listened to it. It was so, so good, like really, really good. So loved it. Um, so yeah. So those are my favorite books that I have loved or have been loving for the month of November. Now for favorite movies. There are two films that I, I really enjoyed this month. One was Suicide Squad. Finally watched that. That was actually really, really good. So I enjoyed Suicide Squad. And the next movie that I really loved and I highly recommend you guys go watch it is Fantastic Beasts and where to find them. Oh my god, that movie was awesome! It was so, so good. Like, really, really good. I'm just going to flip, flip the viewfinder over. Hold on a second. Okay, yeah, that movie was so good. Like, oh my god, if you're a fan of Harry Potter, you'll love this movie. It is so good. Like, really, really, really good. It's just brilliant. Loved it. Okay, yeah. So uh, love that movie. Definitely gonna go see it again. Okay, next, let's move on to makeup. Okay. Oh, I'm missing some stuff. Hold on, I'll be right back. Hold on a sec. Okay, so the first item I've been loving is the Buy Or um, Free Your Pores Pore Detoxifying Foam Cleanser. This stuff is amazing. This is what it looks like. 
and I really like it. It's a good uh, foaming cleanser. It's just, oh my god, it's just really good. It leaves like a sort of tingly feeling on, on your skin and uh, it's really good. Like I like, I can feel it like cleaning out my pores. It's really nice and also it's oil free, so that's good. But yeah, like that. Next is the L'Oreal Skin Perfection Correcting Day Moisturizer. This stuff is amazing. I mean, it's just amazing. I'll show you what it looks like. This is what the cream looks like. It's like a light pink color. It's really, really nice. And I have been really liking this and I love the packaging. I mean, L'Oreal really knows how to do good packaging. It's really nice. Next is the It's Potent Eye Cream by Benefit. This stuff is amazing. I love it. So this is what the cream looks like. And yeah, I really like it. I love the packaging too. It's really cute. Okay, so that's it for skincare. Next is eyeshadow palettes. Now I've been loving the Too Faced Semi Sweet Chocolate Bar Palette and the Bon Bon's Palette. As you guys know, these are my holy grails. I love these. They're so good. I've mostly been using this palette this month, the Bon Bon's, um, for like when I go like to the, down to the coast or I'm traveling and stuff. I do take this palette because I can create like a lot of different looks with this, and I love it. And I also really love this as well. I love them both. They're both really, really good palettes, and I just love them so much. Okay, next is. Um, makeup wipes. These are the Garnier Skin Active Marcel Cleansing Wipes in Oil. These are amazing and, and yes, they are empty. I just ran out um, just last night and they are amazing. I'm going to get some more and uh, yeah, love them. Love them. So good. Next is a foundation brush. This is the Sephora 56 uh, Pro Flawless air brush this uh, this brush is amazing it's fantastic I love it um, excuse the fact that it is dirty I'm gonna wash my brushes this weekend but yeah this is amazing oh my god I love this brush so much and this is the first time I've ever used a Sephora brush they're amazing hands down amazing all right next are mascaras um, I've been loving the Roller Lash Mascara from Benefit and the Miss Manga Mega Volume Mascara from L'Oreal. Love these! Amazing! Just love them. Next are eyelashes. Now I'm currently wearing these lashes at the moment. These are the Lovey Luxury Flux Lashes. Um, you can get these at Sephora. These are in Bluebell and they are amazing. This is what the, the packaging looks like but these are what the lashes look like. And they're really nice, like really, really, really nice. So, and they're pretty easy to apply on. So yeah, love it. Um, next is the Jaclyn Hill by Becca um, face and cheek palette. This is amazing. This is the yeah, the Becca by Jaclyn Hill uh, face and cheek palette. I should say. This is an amazing palette. If you have not got this palette, I really recommend you guys go get it. I think they still have it on sephora.com.au. So I would really recommend you guys go get one because they are amazing. I mean, look at that. I mean, just, just look at it. It's just beautiful. And the packaging is great. And you get this giant ass mirror, which is good. Mm -hmm. Nice. Um, eh. oh, scar. Oh, well. Anywho, so yeah, I love it. Alright, next is the. Oops, oops. Try not to get makeup on my new bed. Maybe I should just. I'm just gonna put this tub on my lap. Um, so I've been loving the Maybelline Master Contour uh, Contour Kit. This is amazing. This is what it looks like. So I, I like. That, I like pretty much like all these, these shades, so you get a contour, a blush, and a highlight, they're amazing. Um, yeah, I love them. They're really, really good. This is in light to medium number 10, and I like this palette. It's really nice. Next is my favorite under eye um, 
setting powder. This is the Astra Australia's Australis. Sorry, I always keep butchering this name. Australis banana powder. This is amazing. This is what it. Uh -huh. This is what it looks. <laughs> it looks like, and it's my favorite banana powder ever. I just I love this setting powder. It's so amazing for setting my concealers. It's just amazing. Speaking of concealers, I have been loving the by the It Cosmetics by Bun Under Eye Concealer, which I need to get a new one soon because this is pretty much wear and tear. Ugh. This is in the shade light. And I've also been loving the Master Conceal by Maybelline in Fair. Love it. I love mixing. I love also mixing these two concealers together. They're fantastic. Alright, next is the um, Chocolate uh, Soleil um, in Medium Deep by Too Faced. This is their little sample bronzer. And that's what it looks like. And I love it. And I'm definitely going to get the full size when I run out of this. For sure. Alright, next is my favorite liquid liner. This is the Hyper Shop Wing Liner by Maybelline. I love it. It's fantastic. And lastly, is my favorite setting powder of uh, not setting powder setting spray next to the Urban Decay All Night Over Makeup Setting Spray, which you guys know is my holy grail. The Smashbox Photo Finish Water Primer. I love this. Oh my god, I love it. I absolutely love it. It's fantastic. It's amazing. It's so good. Oh, I love it. So yeah, I love love this <laughs> this uh, primer water. It's it's fantastic. It really is. And it's just amazing, and it really it sets your makeup, and it doesn't budge all day. So I love it. Okay, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up, and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're not already. Just click that big red button down below. Um, and yeah, because uh, I've got some really, really, really cool videos coming up, especially now we're coming into Christmas! Yay! I'm so excited for Christmas, and I am doing Vlogmas, if I haven't already mentioned it already. I'm doing Vlogmas this year. Yay! And I'm also doing, uh, 12 Days of Christmas, which starts on December 5th, and goes right until December 16th. So it's only for 12 days, and I'm very, very excited. I've got some fun videos planned for that. Um, so yeah, thank you. So that's that's about it. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in my next video. I love you guys so much. Stay beautiful. Bye. Bye, guys. I love you. Bye.